Hey guys and welcome to my channel and welcome to this video. Today I wanted to share with you this super super simple painting and you know what I made myself some coffee and I decided well I do want to do a very very quick and easy painting so I might as well turn on my camera and share the process with you guys and I will be using this, this is arch watercolor paper, it's smaller size, something like A5 size and also will be using my watercolors, these are vibrant and soft sets and I'm just, since this is a single sheet of paper, I'm just gluing it on top of this board, this is the board that I'm using from previous, from the, I guess the block of paper that I just used up and I got left with this board and it's super fun I just put some Mod Podge on top of it and I use it for stretching my papers especially when they're just smaller papers like this. First prevented the entire paper and while that was just soaking in I mixed my paints and I did wanted to create this gray stone background after all it is winter coming you know what I guess the fall wasn't even really here because like two weeks ago I was in my in short sleeves and now it's just freezing it we had frost this morning and it's like we skipped fall it's just winter and I saw the the um, weather forecast and it's saying that it's gonna be minus every day not really every day but you know nights and I'm just, wow, it's, it just came too fast. I was looking for winter, but I guess not that fast. So as I was saying, let's just get back to painting. I did put my background in just a very, very light wash with larger brush, larger flat brush. And then on top, added some splatters, dried it, left it to dry. And now we have this beautiful, sweet, background that it's somewhat, somewhat uh, winterish. This just gives this cooler feel. And on top I'm drawing this heart shape leaves. And for the leaves I will be using some pinks and violets, lilacs. That's just I guess my mood today. And I did notice that a lot of the times I'm just painting how how I feel you know okay, I'm just going back to my previous videos and paintings and just looking and I can just definitely see what mood I was in when I was painting you know guys it's just this is super fun because when I'm in a I don't know cozy mood I do like to use warmer tones and when I'm just cold and in this cooler I like to use um, cooler tones and today well, this very, very, I didn't have really a lot of time to paint today and to record this video, but I thought this might be quite fun. You can definitely use this for some card project and it's super simple idea. So as you can see, I did start with a very, very transparent wash. I wanted my, I wanted my leaf to be uh, transparent in some parts and also to that background to be slightly visible. And then on still wet paper, on still wet leaf, I was adding a little bit of the, a little bit more saturated paint just to create some, I guess, texture. You can see me right now going on the sides with a smaller brush and adding a little bit of the paint just to let it bleed into my leaf and create the textures. I love, I love these two colors. They just mesh very well together and they're just so soft and so sweet and you know, like my sweater, <laughs> cozy and I wanted to put those super sweet colors on top of my cooler background and just adding some central veins. Just remember this is not a realistic painting at all. It's quite simplistic. So just adding those veins, a hint of them actually, with this brownish tone and you know the level of details you want to add onto your leaves is just completely up to you. Have fun, as much fun as you like. If you want to, you know, maybe go over them with some lines, 
horizontal or vertical or you might want to use ink here that's also a great idea if you would like to add some ink on top some splatters I won't be splattering around the leaves I'm just gonna do a little bit of the splatters on the leaf so if you're not sure if you can keep your splatters on the leaves just cover everything around it adding a little bit more of the paint some dots again leaving that one for now and moving on to the last one the third one again a very very light wash of the paint same colors on top adding a little bit more of the details and you can see that the background is showing through really really nicely again some details some dots lines whatever you like to put on your leaves some veins and stem on the top and as I was saying I, I was really feeling like painting a fun quick painting today and I know you guys love that you love those little cute simple projects so I wanted to share it with you I might give you an idea you can paint here some maybe bulbs Christmas ornaments and hang them on a string that's also fine you don't have to have these heart shapes you can make them round or, or also they can be a heart shape why not why Christmas ornaments can be a heart shape a little bit of the splatters and I was just going back adding just a tiny bit more of the details here and there and adding some veins with this brush that I really do love to use for for line work very very thin lines it's just adding a couple of more of the details And I'm not really trying to be precise or, you know, just having fun. And a bit more of the splatters on top of my leaves. And they were just being too dark, so I picked up with the clean towel just to make them slightly lighter and now painting in some lines wires on which my ornaments or leaves are hanging drying and that's it we are done so super simple quite fun project for you guys for this happy Sunday and happy weekend I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please hit the like button share it comment I always love to read your comments and just to see what you think and thank you so much for watching I hope you are subscribed to my channel if you're not well what are you waiting for there are just so many tutorials there I'm sure you will definitely find something for yourself again thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time bye